Nuclear sites, whether active, decommissioned, or scheduled to be decommissioned, are critical facilities requiring rigorous and systematic inspection. Roboticized nuclear site inspection ensures the safety of personnel, enables repeatable inspection tasks, and facilitates access in the highly radioactive environments at low cost. This work presents a system and method for autonomous radiation source localization on board an aerial robot in GPS-denied environments. A cesium iodide scintillator and custom-built electronics are used to enable radiation count and spectroscopy measurements to be obtained from the aerial platform. A visual inertial localization pipeline is used to navigate, as well as annotate the radiation measurements with the pose of the aerial robot. Motivated by the constraints of a small aerial robot, the method detailed here provides a strategy for radiation source localization as well as active source seek path planning. The method accounts for the wide variance of radiation counting statistics, the limited endurance of a small aerial robot, as well as the varying uncertainty of the visual inertial localization pipeline. The method further exploits the obtained environmental occupancy map to constrain the source localization solution, providing source localization estimates with very few measurements. When the robot first detects radiation levels above background, it stops and dwells, collecting a number of radiation measurements which allows the estimated field intensity to converge to the true mean. Once the field at the dwell point has been estimated, the method draws a series of concentric spheres with varying radii centered at the dwell point. Given the measurements at the dwell point, each sphere represents a surface on which a source of particular intensity can lie in compliance with the inverse square law. After visiting a second dwell point, the method finds the circles of intersection between spheres of different dwell points. These circles of intersection are then discretized into a number of points called intersection points to limit the search base of the algorithm. After the robot visits a third dwell point, the method then evaluates each point of intersection for compliance with the measurements from each other dwell point. Using the derived occupancy map, the method then selects the point with the highest probability and finds the nearest occupied voxel. This voxel is then labeled as the radiation source location. To validate the method, three experiments were conducted. In the first experiment, the robot flies in a predetermined grid pattern dwelling at nine points. The source is localized using the first four measurements. In the second experiment, the robot again flies in a predetermined grid pattern, however the source is attenuated by cinder blocks on two sides. This experiment demonstrates the robustness of the method even in the presence of poor observations. In the final experiment, the robot is autonomously guided towards the radiation source using the active source seeking path planner. In this experiment, the radiation source is localized using the first three measurements.